Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. And as shown in the title, there might be some new lore related maps. We we already got some weird stuff in the substructure map because it was so different than all the others. Having lights that can easily break off, adding spotlights, an elevator, whatever uh, seems to be like a bathroom, and I don't know, centrifuges, a, a classroom, and multiple little balconies. Oh, yeah, and also this room. And, uh, oh, yeah, water area. But something else, which is of note. Ah, crap, I forgot to turn my mods off. This is just to prove that I'm not using mods to get the new thingamajig. As you can see, this is a preview build. Ooh, it has a, it adds a decoupler. It adds this office related stuff. And it adds a new, okay, it's gone. And it adds a new map. Which is something, oh yeah, oh yeah, an enable mine, which we'll get into in just a sec. Look through here, you'll see it's a perfectly fleshed out ventilation area. And if you go over here, you see that there's these little desks, pipes, ventilation. You go through here, there's the water room. We go all the way through here, down, down, the weird room that you want to have seen otherwise. And then there's this, which is an accessible, I don't know, means. There's this, which is just filled with water. And there's many interesting things, such as this fully operational elevator which perfectly works which looks to me more like a maintenance elevator because of the weird buttons but meh and something you may have noticed in the beginning is that there's a new reactor level now, some of you may have already known this if you were following the developer's forum page for People Playground. It has these little, these little thingamajigs over here. It has this service element, which, you guessed it, goes down and up. It can also fully stop. It also has this, which is a bunch of nice and neat computers Ooh. it has the reactor itself it has these areas it has this place which has these weird lights which are not seen anywhere else in the game oh yeah this reactor i'm not sure what type of reactor it is but to me i think it might be an oh crap yeah a dark matter reactor there's this little tesla thing up here let's let's get a good look at it oh no my things have fallen to let's get a good look at it it'll periodically shoot arcs down at the reactor over here let's get a good look at this it seems to have some weird computer stuff in a in a tank I'm unsure on what that does. There's also this section I, over here. And this looks kind of, uh, it doesn't look similar to the... In this area over here, there's multiple areas that look a little similar to the decoupler in some way. There's also these coolant tubes. That's what I'm going to call them, because when you remove both of them, 
the reactor starts heating up. Uh, because this is a preview build, it, it's missing some features like a meltdown. Because if you get to a certain temperature, say it's a critical temperature, but it won't actually do anything. It's missing its power output and probably reactor controls. Also, if you remove this, it removes the entire world. So, um, there's that. I like how that starts. And as you can see, it keeps lowering and lowering. And if you wait enough, which I'm not going to do here, it'll eventually just say low temperature, and then it won't really do anything else with that. But something up, yeah, over here, see? There's also doors in each of these rooms. Like, two doors here, two doors here. There's no doors down here. These two are, well, this isn't exclusive to the map, but whatever this little, this little, this little thing is that allows it to move is exclusive to the map, and this, which I'm unsure on what it is, is exclusive to the map. This may be like an actual computer, this is like a monitor, some people, you know, you know these people. Yeah, these people and people playground can actually see the reactor. Um, these two parts can actually separate. It'll actually start heating up. But you can also do um something else. If you get a heavy object like an anchor and sort of just it'll it'll make it fall apart. You can make it fall apart with these two still intact this won't properly arc and it'll just keep raising and raising blah 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 so something i'm oh. okay. I'm, just, I'm still gonna keep the coolant pipe connected if the cooling pipe is still connected, it's still... But now it's heating, which makes... So either this is the reactor, or this... Either this is the reactor, and this is just like a big control thingamajig that takes some power and regulates it and whatnot, which make it not make too much sense why there's all this equipment on it and stuff here but for now that's pretty much it um this video is going to end on a different video that's from the forum that shows the reactor startup sequence i think it was actually the, it was also the first time I saw this map because I was really craving for more people playground content. So I guess I'll see you guys in the next video and enjoy this startup video. Adios.